I think I'm too tall. You're not too tall. You're just taller. I think, yeah, I think I'm a, I'm just a little bit just a little bit too tall. <laughs> okay, hi guys. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Sandra. Sandra, say hi. Hi guys. <laughs> yes, it's Mr. Fair again. Yeah, and um, today we have Sandra. She's a first year game student. Mm -hmm. She got in last year. And uh, I feel like this would be a nice time to sensitize you and, you know, kind of um, mm -hmm. give you, we call you beam here, encouragement to work hard and get in here into, into med school here in, um, in Ghana, well, all of you that have applied. So Sandra is going to share her experience with us on um, how the first year has been so far. Basically, we're going to hear what Sandra thinks about this because if I tell you how I feel, you'll be like... Nah, she's just saying that because she wants us to watch her video. But yeah, Sandra. <laughs> but Sandra is going to be very candid. She's going to be very, very, very candid and candid with us. And by the way, she is. She has a uh, kind of. Um, she has a YouTube channel brewing. So yeah, if you get, uh, you know, you want to get a little bit of a feel, like a little bit of an American accent. Oh my God. You're tired of a <laughs> watered down British no, accent. I don't have an American accent. Oh, oh, what, what's that? No, I don't. What accent is that? Yeah, it's just an accent. I don't know what it is, but it's not American. Yeah, that's what I thought. So if you want a different accent, other than my water dead British Nigerian Ghanaian <laughs> accent, you can pop over to our channel. I'll put a description, like I'll put her channel on it somewhere here, and then I'll put a link to it in my description box. So if you are here and you've not even subscribed to my channel, and then you've not taken a break to subscribe to Sandra's channel. <laughs> I don't know what you're doing here, but anyways, <laughs> I get it. You just want to do the exam and pass and blah blah blah. It's okay, it's fine. So we're gonna we'll get forgive you. Yeah, we'll forgive you. <laughs> but right now, I think you should just like click on the subscribe button and then click on the bell to get notified because this year we plan to do great things, don't we? Absolutely. Yeah, we, we <laughs> it's actually, 2019. Yes, we're um, bringing it. We're bringing it. <laughs> we're bringing everything. Everything. We're bringing everything to the table. So yeah, find the access course. Um, it was. I don't even know how to describe it. So it was two weeks of intense learning. Yeah. <laughs> I'm glad I took it though. I yeah. think it was worth it to yeah. come. I don't think I don't think I would have passed actually if I didn't take the access course. Not because I didn't know that information, but because there's just it's just so wide. Like you would not if you don't the take the course. Information they want from you. Exactly. So you would also if you, if you hadn't taken the course, then you, I would have studied like things that they wouldn't have needed me to study. Yeah. Whereas if once I came to the course and I needed what topics I was. I needed to study, uh, be um, examined on. Yes. So it helped concentrate areas for me. Mm -hmm. So I'm glad I came. It was, um, it was, it was brutal. It, it definitely was. Like I. <laughs> it's what I call the rat race. I, oh, I think okay. I said that then. I was like, it's like a rat race. And then if <laughs> if you've managed to make it through the access course and you take that um, motivation and what's not into the first semester, you'll be fine. Yeah, it's true. Because. Um, Another reason why I'm glad I came to the access course is because is um, I was able to talk to people. Yeah. Like you were able to talk to us, yes. but also um, other students who are already in the in the program. So you get to talk to people and ask questions, any questions that you have, and um, I don't know, like the motivation and just just being able to just hear being around people, hear from people that are studying. Even if you're getting tired of studying, you speak you speak about studying. It's true. You get gingered to study as well. Yeah. But yeah. Because um, even I was I was saying in Kish at the time, so yeah. I would see people who are already in the program like going to the study room to study yeah. and I was just like oh. if they're studying I must well study. That kind of thing. If they're studying so I must well you know study as well. Yeah, so that kind of thing, yeah. That works. Um for me there's no one who came to welcome me into the program or what's not. I was just there by myself. And then I didn't know which there were other Nigerians. Apparently, some other people knew other Nigerians here mm -hmm. and every other thing, but I was like on my own, mm -hmm. like on my own, like mm -hmm. that kind of thing. And I studied by myself, there wasn't any study group or whatnot. Mm -hmm. I just met wow. one, yeah. I met, well, I, I don't mean, know how you did that because I feel like the only reason why I was able to get through it was because of other people, like yeah. studying with other people. But, I mean, I just knew this is what I wanted to do and mm -hmm. I wanted to get in. And mine is not a typical story, so I'm just trying to say. You don't. You, 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 if you have people to encourage you, like she did, it's great. But if you come and there's no one to encourage you, my friend, be your own motivation. You can do it. Yeah. Like if you watch my earlier videos, I said if you need anyone to motivate you before you pass, then GEMP is not for you. Mm. You have to motivate yourself on yeah. a daily. Like yeah, you have to be your own motivation. You have to like just I'm like, damn, I want to be great. I have to study. Like that literally. You have I to, agree. Yeah, you have to be your own motivation. So. 
when when I um, we, I met Bolade and then she was like sitting right next to me and then we were like oh these two Nigerians are like sitting in front because my eyesight was so bad like I was studying so hard my eyesight went bad mm. that's like it went worse <laughs> wow like, it was, I'm serious guys I'm not even exaggerating like I had to change my prescription when I went home mm. because it was so bad and like, I was having this headache so I couldn't see from the back even with my glasses on so I had to like sit right in front and like So and then record the lectures and um, record lectures like you know and all that so i think i put in a lot of work i remember then like i said earlier i was sleeping for two hours a night and i was like, what yes i was that sleeping is, for two hours that's that crazy is i know because that my commute insane. time a day is about an hour and 30 minutes um, and because i didn't want that to affect my study i took the i took it out of my sleeping time um, so the many 30 minutes was for me to bath eat and do what i want to do so that's two hours of my time i won't be studying and I had to get it back so i took it for my sleep so I was on a diet of um, cereal and uh, what's it called, um, coffee. Like I'm eating my cereal. When I make my cereal, instead of putting milk in my cereal, I put coffee. Like caffeine, caffeinated coffee. Girl. Yeah, I went hard. I knew oh. what I wanted. I like, I definitely knew what I wanted, guys. And I, <laughs> and I, and I, and I went for it. I, I'm feeling anxious just listening to her. <laughs> <laughs> like, the, the coffee and cereal. Uh-uh. Legit. Girl, that, that, that wow. actually, that's actually what I did. Gotcha. Like I remember when I came back here and then my, my mom, when I got home, my mom was like, what are you doing? How did you get here? She had to win me off coffee. Oh, oh my god. Like if I hadn't gotten coffee at eight o'clock, I start like I start having the shakes. Oh wow. Like I was having withdrawal symptoms and everything. Girl. Yeah. But I got what I wanted. I'm not saying she got that, but if it takes just doing it for two weeks to get in here, mm-hmm. do it. Do what you need to do for the for sure. Do. I support like, that. Do what because it will be, the, the feeling is worth it. Mm-hmm. When you get like your when you see your name? name? Yes. Oh my god. Do you, know, do you know what I was doing when I saw my name? I was just like sitting in the house. Like, I couldn't be me. Like I wasn't settled. I just like I was watching TV. I like literally TV was watching me. Because <laughs> you know, because they were so friendly with me in the Air, Airbnb, so they invited mm. me to watch TV with oh, them. Nice. Do you want to go to the beach with us? Yeah. Just to kind of get me to calm down. Yeah. Guys, it was just 24 hours. Where I, was it even up to 24 hours? No. We literally we saw the result that evening or the oh, next okay. day. Yeah. We got ours the next day. It was yeah. supposed to be the next day. Yeah. And I just had to calm down with I couldn't calm down. Like, I couldn't be still. I was just like, okay. let's go to the beach. I'm like, sure, sure. We went to the mall, went to eat. But it's like the food was eating me. The movie was watching me. Like, I couldn't be still. Yeah. Then Bala, they called me. just like, if I, I was like, yeah, I can see your name. I said, like, what does that mean? It means you've passed. I was like, wait, do you mean I'm in med school? She was like, yes, you're in med school. I was like, yeah. Like, I just like, I was. I was sleeping <laughs> when, when the news came because um we like, yeah I think it was around noon yes and Jola she came she knocked on my door yes. I was like no I just want to sleep leave me alone she's like Sandra no seriously just open the door the results are out I'm like what what and I looked at it I was screaming like I, I I was just I was just jumping in my room and on my bed I think on my bed too I was screaming I called my like, I called everyone your bed right there, I just like care. I was like Kish can make me pay for their stupid bed whatever yes. I'm in I'm in yes. I'll be here I'll be yes. here to pay for it. So I called my parents and my, my dad and like my friends and stuff, but it was, I was, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> like my mind was, actually, let me ask that. Um, I remember, so I think I was like the fifth person. Yeah. Um, on our list. Yeah. So, um, the people before that, before me were telling us, you know, what questions they were asking them. Yeah. Presidents and stuff. Mm-hmm. So when I got in there, um, I barely actually remember what my questions were. I, I just remember trying to make sure that I had command of myself yeah. and command of whatever words came out of my mouth. Yeah. So whatever question that I, I I barely remember my ethics question. No, I think I think it was about um if um if let's say the mother of your patient of your child of of your yeah. patient who's a child yeah. um does not want um the child to get a blood transfusion I, because I, of their religion or something like that right was going to come through. so that was my question so I, I i'd already like people were telling me we already had an idea of what the ethics yeah. questions might be so i was prepared but still each time i was just like just make sure you have command of yourself command of whatever's coming out of your mouth just look like you're composed and yeah. stuff and even when it came to um they asked me i don't know th- that's me some the name of s- some president and i oh my god they did ask i was just <laughs> like i was just like um they asked me the Ghanaian president and i knew there was someone. There was, I don't remember the country. That's how much I I don't I don't I don't care. I don't remember. But I just remember being like, you know, I don't think I can recall at this time or some some dumb shit like that. But either way, I was just like, I'm not going to apologize for not knowing who this person is. I'm going to be honest. Exactly. And then say, I don't know. But, but I, 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 I made it look like I, I was taking my time to really, you know. 
<laughs> look composed and stuff. But yeah, but you should, I think you should, I think I was fine because point. of because of trying to make sure that I do not look shaken. Yeah, yeah, you, you ha- like you have to get it together. It comes yeah. with the pressure and the pressure and everything. Yeah, you, they, they need to know you. And then for the ethics question, it. there's really no right or right right or wrong answer you get mm-hmm. to see because the 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 the, 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 the margin is quite thin. When you, when you get to do ethics, you get to understand that mm-hmm. it just has to be like. You have to do what is right and you'll be able to defend because should you be charged to court, mm-hmm. there has to be some level of logic and exactly. legality behind what they actually Decision, take in. Yeah. yeah. So you, you you need to understand you're you're dealing with lives. It's not just um, a daily day in day out job. It's mm-hmm. somebody's life. And you need to understand what laws protect that child in that country, mm-hmm. what laws protect the adult. You know, the law is not perfect. There are a little bit of commas. So you need to you need to kind of have an idea. You need to be very well rounded as a doctor. You need to know because my question I remember in my interview video, my question was um, who is the president of Nigeria? What is your workout regime like? Why do you like driving? What kind of cars do you like driving? Mm-hmm. Like, what, 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 how does that? Mm-hmm. Well, like, I think they asked me what I like to do in um, your free outside time. of yeah. Yeah, they and asked then me I was that. like, I, like, I want to work out. You, you want to work out? That's why I said I, I oh, told okay. them like, like I enjoy working. Out. Like, so what's a workout regime like? Oh. Why do you work? I'm like, well, it's not. I think I don't want to tell patients to be fit. Well, I'm not. Yes, yeah, so I want to. Oh, yeah. So they're like, oh, okay. Mm. So even so you see, they, they, and then I think they asked me one ethical question, but mine was more politics, like. They complained about Nigerian president. They huh? them, I'm sure they had to. Harry They're then, like, oh, yeah. Nigerian president. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. They're like, do you like your president? I'm like, he, he was voted into. He's definitely the people's choice. I didn't say yes or no. You see, because mm. honestly, I'm sorry to say, but I, it's not like I don't care. I just feel like whoever is there, you just have to do your best, support them, and let them do what they mm. have to do. If they go in again. I, I really care about Nigeria, about the state and everything. But whoever is there, there's nothing we can do about who is there right now. We just can only affect who is going to come next. Mm. So if you're Nigerian and you're listening, please vote wisely next time. I'm not, I'm, I'm not saying anything. Just vote wisely. That's all. Ask me, and then yeah. they're like, "Oh, he said to yeah. me, slow president." I was like, "I think it's everyone's view. If I'm in an opposing party, I'm definitely going to say things to make my component look bad. So mm. definitely, it's probably something. But personally, I don't have personal views about it. They're like, this is going to be one tough person to shake off. Mm. <laughs> they, they come asking me like really dicey questions, and I'm like, well. I know the British event was coming out. Yeah. Was like, well, did you see well? <laughs> so it was, it was, how did you feel? Uh, how did you feel yeah. getting your seeing your name on the what's it called the result the final list? I so before um, I applied to Ghana, mm-hmm. I'd been applying to other schools and I was just yeah. getting rejected. So I I just felt finally affirmed in my choice to become a doctor. I was like, finally, finally, there's, like, I'm finally going to have this chance yeah. to finally become a Okay, for the um, practice, for the um, exam, the so question just, itself, just do not forget to try standardized tests like USMLE so tests, aside like, yeah, from is, what I have put actually, yeah. on the Google Drive. So, so you just have to go to my Facebook yeah. page, yeah. Yeah. click yeah. on um, the, my Google yeah. Drive. There's a link at the top of the community um, support group. and. So yeah, like read away, really read, start reading for the exam and always, always, always try to solve questions on whatever topic you've read. Try USMLE questions because they are very standard. Okay, so good luck guys. in Russia and Middle East and all that. I got in. I was also good, I got in. So I have not exactly no rejection from medical school. So I thought we'll just read with pass. And as and I wanted to do the MCAT and I saw everyone I was like if we don't get in, okay, well, I'm going to study, I'll do it. Then I applied to American schools, I got in, mm. from private schools, I got in, but I really wanted to get the knowledge of cholera, first hand, tetanus, first hand, malaria, first hand, like, I didn't want to read it in the textbook, you see, I'm black, I feel like I should have a very good hand mm. on, on the things that affect us. Yes, mm-hmm. that, that, like, that is my passion, that mm. is where my passion really lies. It's not like I said, I don't want to treat people of other races, mm. I do, and whether I like it or not, the so-called disease that affects the white people, so to say the Caucasians, is coming here because we're the, the underdeveloped world, we're kind of transitioning a little mm-hmm. bit. There's a, there's, a, there's a transition in the, the, the kind of disease that affect the under the developing world and mm-hmm. the Western world. So it's a bit of a transition. So we have a very fine mix in Ghana here. Mm-hmm. You find people with um, 
textbook conditions you really see in textbooks that say it affects this in Brazil, yeah. and then you're like, oh, it's here too. <laughs> how, how, you see? So you, so you, you we, we get a very fine mix here, and I'm very happy with my choice. Mm -hmm. And then I made the choice because I also wanted to be closer to home. Like mm -hmm. I spent the last four years away from my, and I just, I just wanted to be home, mm -hmm. like okay. home but not home. Nigeria is still across the street, so. Home I home. Yeah. Yeah. So when I saw, when I kind of felt like yeah it's good, but this is one I actually put effort into. So mm. the feeling of getting in was way more than the other ones. I told you I slept for two hours. Child, do you know how stressful that is? Like I'll be really I'm like, <sighs> no, I worked for this one. I was happy. Not like I didn't work for the other ones, but mm -hmm. I was so happy. Yeah. yeah. the best of luck we hope you beat us soon and then i think the international student association will come speak to you which i am the president of yes i know i think I, it's so perfect that she is honestly because she makes herself so available and i feel like if someone's going to be like heading that they should be able to be accessible yeah, yeah she's I, very accessible so that's why i think she's perfect. like literally you see me on campus looking like a regular people mm -hmm. like not just regular person regular people because i can be confused <laughs> smiling was it you you saw me with michelle the other day and i was like i'm hungry i have to go yes yes i remember <laughs> yeah. like i was like hi nice to meet you like, what I'm hungry. Hungry. <laughs> I have to go eat. like that is like that, that is like that's like me that's like yeah. me you find everywhere so yeah, yeah. we'll come talk to you as usual even the Ghanaians, if you know me and you're subscribed here, and then i think just been did that she was like she was so shy to say hi just been in your class Aww. and she's like she texts me the next day, hi, on YouTube, I'm like, hi, I saw you, and I was like, shy to say hi, like, how don't do that. She's I'm, so sweet. I know, I'm like, guess me, don't do that. Yeah. Next time you see me, yeah. say hi. Yeah. And then she said hi the next time, like, Aww. I mean, I came for the international today because I was on the exec then, and now I'm the president, so yeah, I'm just doing my job yeah. for the association. But, but I said, but I said, YouTuber, yeah, please, yeah. if you're subscribed to me, I'm here for YouTube. Yeah. Like, totally come, come through, like, yeah. come through, yeah, that kind of thing, so yeah. Say hi. You see me. You see her. Drag her. Her knowledge is still <laughs> Say fresh. Say hi. I love. Yes. I'm, I'm different. Yeah. So yeah, we, 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 we're, we're really very happy to help. And then once you meet the international society, it's tough for everyone, but we try to be there for each other. We do try. We've got to give it to us. We do try. But yeah. Um. Thank you for listening to us. I think it's almost like 50 minutes. So, <laughs> I actually have fun. I'm way too much I fun. Do have fun. Imagine the stress it's taking to edit it. I know. Good luck. I don't know how. Girl, it's gonna be a lot of work. We will be fine. We will be fine. So thank you guys. The motto. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yes, yes, that actually is the motto. So thanks again and um check her channel out. She may not be a regular right now because I think first semester second semester is a bit Yeah. Plus I <laughs> honestly when it comes to gem stuff, come to her. Like she's very she's I feel like she tackles every question and topic that you could have about it. Legit. That's one thing about her channel. I was looking for your channel. Oh, okay. Yeah, like you're able. I was just like, oh yeah, oh okay. Like she's <laughs> able to, you know, like how um, websites have FAQ, like yes, you know, frequently asked questions. Yeah. To channel for this. So make use of that. I think they should pay me. They should. Honestly. Yeah, actually, I'm gonna like, talk to. Go to. Okay, yeah. I can even go to Legon if you have to. Yeah, like, I, I, I can. Up, yeah, like give me my card. You've been taking our money for so long. I'm doing your job for you. Give me my card. I'm doing the advertising. Yeah, and, I'm doing uh, that. I'm yeah. FAQ and yeah, so, yeah. yeah. But yeah, actually I enjoy doing this because I really struggled and I don't think anyone should struggle like that. Mm -hmm. So that's the motive behind this channel. Mm -hmm. And then yeah, we will we, we'll do some lifestyle and fitness too. Well, I'm, I'm trying to be fit this year. Girl, I'm trying to, but uh, it's a struggle. It's a struggle. We will be fine. <laughs> we will be fine, yes. So yeah, 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 yeah. Let's call, let's call it a day. And then yeah, thank you for watching guys. Thank you for having me. Yeah, oh, please, thank you for coming. <laughs> she actually came to my house, guys. And she walked me clean. <laughs> so cool. <laughs> I was just napping. Okay. Yes. Yeah, which is really cool. Thank you for waiting, actually. Thank mm. you again, everybody. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. bye. Au <laughs> Can you say bye? No.
Um, Jawara Raida. <laughs> I, I don't know how to say like a simple bye. Yeah. We just say bye. I think oh, we just really? say bye. Yeah. Like. Okay. I whether in Luganda or where my language, yeah. which is Yoruba, we we'll just say bye. I think I'm Yoruba anyways, and then we say um, Odabo. Mm. Like we can just say Odabo. That's bye. Like or Odiba. Like till we see again. Oh. Till okay. next time Odiba. Like, uh, but the slang we can say hey, I'm a see so like we we'll see and. So I'm a C so. So because I see the past tense of C is so. Oh. So I'm a C so. But in the real language, it means we'll see and talk more. I love it. It's so creative. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's creative. I like it. I'm a C so. We'll see and talk again. Like we'll see and talk about this again. So we'll see and talk again. So yeah. Yeah, you is quite cool, isn't it? Yeah, but yeah. So bye guys. We're giving you how many bites now? Ten. <laughs> yeah. So take care.